Time now to take a look at what's been happening in the world of sports. Joining us in the studio is our sports editor, Paul Neen. Hello, Paul. Hello there. Let's first start with Major League Baseball. It has been yet another busy weekend for Kim ha -sung. Yes, very productive indeed for him. His San Diego Padres beat the LA Dodgers two games to one in the series. On Sunday, in a game that the Padres went on to win 6-3, Kim drew four walks. That's the most he's achieved in a single MLB game. In the game before that, which the Dodgers won 5-2, Kim ha -sung hit his third double of the season. It came with the Padres 4-1 down in the top of the seventh inning with no runners and two out. He hit a sinker from starting pitcher Gavin Stone. On Friday, the first in the series, and a game that the Padres won 8-7, he hit a solo home run off the highest earning pitcher in MLB, Yoshinobu Yamamoto. It came at the top of the second inning to give the Padres a 3-1 lead. Fans got their money's worth with this one as the game was won in the 11th inning. Meanwhile, Lee Jong-hoo of the San Francisco Giants was able to extend his hitting streak to a career-best six matches. He went one for five with a steal and a run scored on Sunday in the Giants' 9-4 defeat to the Tampa Bay Rays. His run was his seventh of the season and third in as many matches. All right, and moving on to golf now, um, the Masters, a career best for An Byung-hun. Yes, that's right. He finished tied for 16th at two over par. This places An as the highest ranked Asian golfer at this year's Masters and it was his best finish in what was his fifth appearance at the opening major of the year. But only the top 12 are invited back for next year's Masters. He missed out by a single stroke. American Scotty Scheffler won the tournament outright, his second green jacket at Augusta National. He finished at 11 under, four strokes clear of Sweden's Ludwig Oiberg. Meanwhile, Kim Shi-hu and Kim Ju hyung finished tied for 30th at five over. Uh, to football now, uh, there are brand new champions of Germany. Yes, Bayer Leverkusen on Sunday sealed their first ever top division title in Germany. The first in the club's 120-year history. Leverkusen are also the first new champions of Germany since 2009 when Wolfsburg won the Bundesliga that year. And it's the first time that a team other than Bayern Munich have won the league since 2011. The title was sealed on Sunday following a 5-0 win over Werder Bremen. Leverkusen now have 16 points more than their Bavaria rivals Bayern Munich with just 15 points left to play for. Leverkusen are led by Spanish manager Xavi Alonso, who has been linked with Liverpool to replace Jurgen Klopp and Bayern to replace Thomas Tuchel, but now looks set to stay with the club. When he took over in October 2022, the team was second bottom of the table. Remarkable. Finally, to badminton, a long overdue win for South Korea at the Asian Championships. Yes, the team of Lee Sohee and Baek Hana on Sunday won the women's doubles title. That's a first for Korea in 19 years since Lee Gong won and Lee Hyo Jung in 2005. In Nanjing, in China, the pair beat Zhang Xuzhuan and Zheng Yu 2-0, 23-21 and 21-12. This comes after the pair also won the All England Open last month. In the mixed doubles, Korea's So Sung Jae and Che Yu Jong finished runners-up to the hosts, China two sets to one. It looks like all boats were well for the Olympics coming up later this year. Uh, thank you, Paul. See you next week. Thank you. See you.